here with Reed Worley out of Cherokee High School here in Georgia, Kennesaw State commit and a member of the 2025 class for the Prep Baseball All-American Game. Reed, man, I appreciate the time. Yes, sir. Thank you for having me. So, one, tell me how you found out you were going to the Prep Baseball All-American Game and what the reaction was. Yeah, so I was really just sitting in the house with a couple of my friends and uh, Hudson texted me. And he said, what's up, man? I said, hey, how are you? And he just shot me the text and asked if I wanted to go to Miami. So I was super stoked about that. So Hudson Graham, the, the Prep Baseball Georgia scouting director, you're going down there to be part of a 2025 team that won a year ago. Josh Hammond, the MVP, is coming back. Ethan Holiday, the number one player in the class, is going to be there. His dad, Matt, is going to be coaching. So no pressure to go down there and help these guys repeat. No, no, not at all. So tell me about this whirlwind that this is going to be a part of for you. I mean, obviously, uh, in pitching circles, you really blew up this summer. Uh, that slider in particular, 3,300 RPM. What's this summer been like for you and just kind of watching everything unfold? So it's been busy. It's been pretty cool, but just been trying to stay humble and keep my head down and keep going to work and keep producing and showing who I really am. So tell me a little bit about that slider. I know it's really been opening eyes, the development of that pitch, and really when it kind of just started to become the weapon that it is. So I've always thrown it at a young age, so I used to always call it a cutter so I wouldn't get in trouble by coaches. But um, <laughs> I just keep throwing it and throwing it, and it just keeps getting better and better. So hopefully I can carry that into my senior year and keep going from there. I know one of the things scouts really like is the ability to pitch off of the slider. It's almost as effectively as you would a fastball. How long did that process take where you kind of had that comfort level where you could throw it in any count? So really starting getting in high school, we started to utilize it more and start pitching backwards. So I've always had to be a pitcher and not a thrower. So kind of always throughout my whole time of pitching, but definitely high school, early high school years have been doing that. What's the next development for you? Is it fastball command? Is it, are you maybe tinkering with another pitch that we might see you throwing out? Definitely down fastball command with being able to throw a sinker. And then I want to develop a four seam so I can get something flat and up in the zone. What's the process to make that happen? Because when you've kind of established yourself with certain pitches, when do you feel like, okay, maybe I can kind of start working something into the mix? So definitely the off-season. I think in season is not the time to mess with anything if you're on a roll. But uh, off-season going into high school season is going to be when I use that and go into effect with that. So Kennesaw State, you, by the time we get to signing day, it'll be nearly two years uh, since you made your commitment to them. I'm sure with the amount of noise that you've made this summer, there maybe have been some overtures, coaches wondering, okay, how strong is that commitment to the Owls? So put it out, I mean, how, how much do you want to be a part of that program? 100% all in. I talk about it every day to certain people. They're always asking, but I'm 100% all into them. They've shown a ton of loyalty and respect, and I can just keep going with that. So, 2021, you were a junior future gamer. Uh, you established yourself as one of the top pitchers in the state of Georgia, become one of the top pitchers in the nation, now a prep baseball American. If you could go back to Reed Worley in 2021 during those future games and tell him something, some piece of advice about the journey that was ahead, what would it be? You know, I'd just say... Stay humble and keep your head down. Keep going to work no matter if people underestimate you. Just keep doing what you do best. So, Well, Reed, cannot wait to see you work in Miami. Appreciate the time, man. Yes, sir. Thank you for having me. You're welcome. Make sure you keep it locked right here. We'll have plenty more going into the 2024 Prep Baseball All-American Game.